because we live in the greatest time of the history of the freaking world opportunities everywhere entrepreneurship's everywhere dude freaking opportunity is everywhere you want your way out just open your eyes it's in front of you you want to know how to do something be the best at it get ready just open your eyes let your mind run hey guys andy elliott in this video i want to talk to you about five signs that will show you if you're gonna be successful. If you look at these five things that I'm about to talk about, and if you can line up all five of these, well, number one, here's what I'll tell you. It worked for me, okay? And I am living proof that you, that you can be as successful as you want, but there's kind of a little blueprint that I'm gonna go over during this video that if you'll follow, number one, I follow it. I eat, sleep, and breathe by these five rules, these five pillars these five secrets, these five hacks. And so these are five signs that if you're doing these things, I know you'll be successful. So grab a pen, grab a piece of paper. I want you to just like this, always have something to write on, okay? Here's, here's how your mind works. Your mind deletes information all day long, okay? So as I'm talking to you, you wanna write down the things that I'm talking about because if you do write it down, what's written will be retained and that way you will remember this stuff. Now it'll go into your mind and now you can change your life. All right, guys, number one, here we go. Let's just get right into it. Number one, write this down. Always be learning, be coachable. This right here is probably one of the most important things. I see these people walking around and they're closed-minded. They're not open-minded to there could be a better way or there could be a different way. Or maybe, I'm gonna give you an example. Everybody write this down, methods. So number one, I'm really good at sales. I have a very good methodology of the way that I sell, the way I close, the way I influence, the way I persuade. But also, if this guy over here is getting kick-ass results too, think about it. I got my way and then he's kicking butt that way and then this person over there is getting a lot of results that way. Wouldn't I want to learn all the ways? Yes. The fact that we're human beings and we're alive in an era right now where literally self-development is everywhere and we can learn, you got to be open-minded and you got to be coachable. One of the things that you'll learn, NFL players, they practice every single day? Yes. The better you get, the more you train, the more you practice, the more coachable you become. The second you think that you can't get beat, you're gonna get beat. That's the way it works. So you gotta be coachable. This is a super important thing that I want you adapt to adapt to. I want you to uh, adopt this. I want you to take this as a part of your life and I want you to never get rid of it no matter what. Be the most coachable person in the room. My friends, guys, I, I run a $100 million business. My friends that I'm around that run eight, nine, 10 figure businesses, every time they're in the room, anytime someone else is talking, they're never trying to tell everyone how much they know. They're always trying to listen and learn and take something from that person. Even though they're extremely successful, they're still trying to learn every day in every conversation from everyone. I was just talking this morning, there was a janitor, right? I'm just telling you, a janitor, a guy that is coming up in a company somewhere that's starting from the bottom that taught me something today. Anyone can teach you anything, okay? So always be open-minded, okay? Always be in the growth mindset at all times. Never be closed-minded and always understand this, right? Take what's good and leave the rest. Does that make sense? Okay, like understand your mind's a filter, you're the gatekeeper of your mind, but you need to always realize that a lot of people, they just stop being coachable. They, 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 they self-develop to a certain point to they make a certain amount of money or they get to a certain level and then they stop. The person that self developed forever and they never stop and they keep learning from everyone, that's the most dangerous person in the room and this could be the greatest advice you'll ever get. Let's get to number two. All right, so number two is gonna be super competitiveness. This is super important. This person always wants to be number one. They always have to be the best, okay? Whether I was the best or whether I wasn't the best physically in numbers, I always believed that I was the best. I need you to understand this, okay? If you believe, if you're last in a company, you're dead last, everyone else is better than you, if you think, oh man, I'm dead last, you're smoked. You must always believe I'm gonna be the best. I may not be the best today, but I will be the best eventually. Eventually, I will be number one. Everybody will be chasing me right now. I am going to get that person. I am the best. You must look in the, in the mirror and you must say, I am the best. I am the best. I believe in myself. It's delusional belief. I, when I started my sales training company, I said, I got the world's number one sales training company. I've got it, I've got the world's number one. No one else knows it yet, but I know. <laughs> Does that make sense? And then all of a sudden, 500,000 clients later, okay, 150 million views every 30 days on social media, 10,000 companies later, the world says, that guy has the world's number one sales training company. That's what I'm talking about, baby. So if you're sitting there and you're watching this, all right, 
You're the best. You gotta be competitive, okay? That's the way you win. This is how winners operate. So you have to think this way. All right, let's get to number three. All right, guys, so number three, write this down. My circle out succeeds me. What does that mean? Well, number one, are you the greatest person in your circle? I want you to think about the five people that you hang around with right now, the 10 people, 15 people you run with. Are you the greatest of all of them? If you're earning more money, if you've got a better marriage, if you're a better parent than all of these, if you're in the best shape, dude, you need to find another circle. You say, well, Andy, these are my family. These are my friends. Okay, I didn't say go get rid of them. I said plug into another circle. Plug into a bigger circle where the guys in the room are in better shape than you. They literally out succeed you. They earn more money than you. They have better marriages than you. They're even better parents than you. They like themselves more. They're hungrier than you. Plug into those circles. So if you want to win, if you want to be the best, you got to plug into circles that out succeed you. Guys, before we get to number four, before we get to number five, I would be a fool to not tell you about an opportunity that you could get into a circle that does out succeed you, to a circle that will push you, that will positively peer pressure you, that will stretch you every freaking day. Tell you the cold hard truth, not walk around on eggshells with you, and if you have a hole, help you fix it and help you become elite, help you become the best, and know that in life you got one, and we're not going to die with regrets, and we're going to become great, and we're going to become great right freaking now. Guys, I have a coaching program where literally I, co I coach the greatest entrepreneurs, entrepreneurs, CEOs, salespeople, and businessmen and women all around the world. Below, in the, in the YouTube description box, if you scroll below and you see in the YouTube description box, there's a little link that says Coach with Andy, okay? When you see that, it doesn't mean that I've accepted you to coach with me. It means this that if you believe that you can take positive peer pressure, you can take criticism, like what winners take, hey, this is what you need to do to become great. This is what, do this and that's gonna happen. And you wanna be coached. And by the way, you've been running a play and maybe the results you're getting aren't what you want, so you wanna run a new play. Or you're getting big results and now you wanna get them even bigger. If that's you, I coach the greatest in the world. My goal, my goal, my personal goal is to create the greatest leaders that ever existed on planet Earth. To help people get rich, and have rich lives. Get it all. And if you feel like that's what you want, go down to that link. You're gonna enter your name, your phone number, your email. You're gonna answer eight questions. And if those eight questions, when you answer them, that aligns with the way that I believe, I'll reach out to you in the next 24 hours. Guys, I love you, this is an opportunity. If you wanna plug in, there you go, links below. Answer the questions, enter your information right. Let's kick some ass. Let's get back to the video. All right guys, number four, write this down. Mind never stops. What does that mean? That means your mind never shuts off. I literally, everybody's always like, Andy, why is your mind always going like 9 million miles an hour? Because we live in the greatest time of the history of the freaking world. Opportunities everywhere. Entrepreneurship's everywhere. Dude, freaking opportunity is everywhere. You want your way out? Just open your eyes. It's in front of you. You want to know how to do something and be the best at it? Get ready. Just open your eyes. Let your mind run. The, the greatest things God ever gave you in your life was a heart and a mind. And if you examine your heart and you got a good heart and then you take your mind and you train it and you use it, the mind will make you wealthy, okay? The mind can never turn off, okay? The mind is one of the most important things that'll make someone successful. So make sure your mind never shuts off. Let that thing run. Your mind is a superpower. It's a dangerous weapon, okay? If anyone ever tells you, man, shut it off. Tell them to shut up. Don't you ever shut it off, okay? I promise you, man, there's a day that it will be shut off. Okay, so if you have the ability to use it right now, understand it's a superpower. It's your, it's your secret weapon, okay? So I love you guys. Let that mind run, use it, okay? Use it or lose it, okay? Listen to what they say and turn it off and become nothing. Or listen to what I say, crank that sucker up. Let's kick some ass. Let's get to number five. Number five is gonna be be extremely, we underline extremely like 900 times, as many times as you can, obsessive. Listen, be obsessed or be average. I know you've heard that before, but I want you to understand this. If you don't become obsessed, you will be forced to become average. There's, there's no way around it. Like you, you can't not be average if you're not obsessed. Obsessed means that if you're not the best, if you're not the top 1%, and even when you are the top 1%, you can't turn it off. You have to figure out how to do it better, how to do it faster, okay? How to do it more efficiently, you know what I'm saying? How to do it and have more fun, how to do it and be more loving while doing it. 
you know, like I wanna tell you, I'm obsessed about life. I love life. I love everything about life. I'm obsessed with being a great parent. I'm obsessed with um, being an awesome husband and my wife. I'm obsessed with being close to God. I'm obsessed with being physically fit. I'm obsessed with being a great leader in my team. I'm, I'm obsessed with looking in the mirror and being proud of me. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with changing your life. I'm obsessed. And I wanna tell you guys that when you become obsessed, you're gonna be successful. Follow these five things. I promise you, if you can master these five things, just master them. Total immersion in them. You can't be beat. And by the way, if you need help, okay, if you're serious, like, and you know, like I always tell someone, like, how do I know if someone's serious? Urgency. It's very simple. If you're serious about a new life, about an edge, about becoming better, okay, cool. Well, then you have to bet on you. And you guys can go down to the description box, and if you believe that you're looking for a great coach to push you, to help you become something that you can't become on your own, or else you would already be it, to help you get to that next level, go down there, answer those eight questions, fill out your information right, and if it aligns with my core values and the things that I want and how I want to push and how you want to push, well then I'll reach out to you in the next 24 hours and let's rock the world. I love you guys, have a blessed day. I made this video for you. If you're following these five things and you're on track, guess what? I love it, man. Keep it up. Don't stop. Thank you for being a great example for others in the world. See you in the next video.